Could I take you to the Statue of Liberty, please? Do I have a tour for you? It's $40 per adult. We're gonna take you on a one hour boat. You're gonna see the Statue of Liberty plus a lot of other New York attractions. What's even better is the children are free. You just have to take a shuttle bus to get to our ferry. That tour sounds good, we'll take it. What does that P stand for on your hat? The P stands for ferry. Now all you have to do is just follow that man over there and you'll get a short bus ride to the ferry. Use your ticket, enjoy your tour. Hi, Fuzzy and Hi, Fuzzy and Bye. Another sucker was handed. These scammers got another tourist. Tours are us? I thought it was the Staten Island Ferry. Something doesn't feel right here at all. You know what? I think you're right. I thought we were going to the Statue of Liberty. Why would we drive away from the water? I have no idea. Oh dear! I wanted to see the Statue of Liberty. Actor Alec Baldwin is perhaps giving us all a good reminder about a well-known scam. And today, New York City's helping out and is going after illegal tour operators. Baldwin posted that he and his family bought tickets for what was supposed to be a boat cruise around the Statue of Liberty. But it was in an area notorious for those tricking tourists. That's because he bought a ticket from a street vendor, not from Statue Cruises, which sells tickets inside Battery Park and operates the only boat that will take you to the island. The city's clamped down before, and now the mayor is taking it a step further. Tuesday, he announced a new coordinated effort with the NYPD, Parks Police, and others. Come in at my Battery Park. Another poor tourist got had by these scammers. We really have to do something about this. Turn around. You're under arrest. Don't ever scam these poor New York tourists again. I didn't do anything. Your little fake trip just cost you some time behind bars. So tourists, be very aware that there are scammers out there and they may look legitimate. Do your due diligence and find out and buy tickets from the proper sources. Places like Tours R Us, they may look legitimate, but they're not. 